Hey everybody, this is Bernie and Chris, and our co-worker and our buddy Blaine claims to be the biggest Star Wars fan in the world, in a world full of Star Wars fans. Yeah, and because he is the biggest fan in the world, we decided to get him something very, very special. Very special. An early screening of Star Wars The Force Awakens, four days early to be exact. There's only one problem, is that we couldn't actually get the movie, but we still booked a theater to show him maybe something else. Oops. Alright, just got a message that Blaine is now on his way to the office. Hey, hey, hey. Alright, I'm gonna, I gotta get my giggles out first. Hey, Brian. Hey, dude, what's up, man? I got an email. I'm like way behind this, so I hope it actually works out. You know Mac? He works at Lucas. I don't think I've ever heard of Mac. He's got an opportunity for, there's an early screening of Star Wars. You wanna do it? Yeah. Okay, totally. we'll call him and see what he needs. Hey, is this Bernie? Yeah, hey, what's going on, man? Blaine is like one of our real heavy hitters on social media here. He's also like far not our biggest Star Wars fan. Would you say? Point out, I, I will take that title. Yeah. Yeah, the audience is really well aware of what a big fan uh, Blaine is of Star Wars. So forgive me if Bernie's already said any of this, but we need you <clears throat> to say, you know, in a couple sentences, like why you're the biggest Star Wars fan. And we also need you to do some impressions. Okay. I can do impressions. Yeah. So uh, what, what would the characters be that you needed to do an impression of? Uh, Chewbacca, Leia, Lando Calrissian, R2-D2, a Tauntaun. I don't have to tell you what that is. Jabba the Hutt. Uh, Mace Windu is the next one. Uh, also from episode one, Watto, Darth Maul, Jar Jar Binks. Did you really? You guys are doing Jar Jar? Yeah, but you know what? In this, we're trying to go sort of holistically and embrace everything. You guys know what you're doing, I'm sure. They don't all necessarily have to be uh, verbal. I mean, if you want to throw in some moves. And for the screening, if you could show up in costume. I'm like, I'm going to be okay with that. Yeah. Quick question. I have like a full Jar Jar outfit. That's cool if I wear that, right? Yeah, no, that's great. I noticed this short notice. Does all this seem doable? Oh, totally. Yeah, for Star Wars? Yeah. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs> He's got a Jar Jar costume? That's weird. Thank, Thank you so much, Bernie. Come here, man. Oh, my God. I'm <laughs> so good. It's so good to see you. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's so good to see you, too, man. Oh. Sit down so other people can see you on camera. <laughs> I know you're part of this. I've never hugged Blaine ever. And so now it's like, I know I'm definitely going to hell after this. The oppression of the Sith will never return. You have lost. You've been invited to a VIP screening of Star Wars Force Awakens? You, sir, down there! I'm seeing Star Wars tomorrow! Go to hell! Hey guys, I'm less than an hour away from going to one of the world's first ever Force Awakens screenings, and I figured I'd go dress as one of my favorite Star Wars characters. Misa, so excited! So, I'm about to get out of the car and go see the movie. I leave a boy, and I come back a man. A man who has seen Star Wars The Force Awakens. Without further ado, I present to you Star Wars The Force Awakens. Thank you guys so much. Aren't you a little short to be a stormtrooper? I'm a Toydarian! Mind tricks don't work on me! Only money! <laughs> At last we will reveal ourselves to the Jedi. At last we will have our revenge. <laughs> oh jeez. Now, 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 you will die! Unlimited power!
I, I had nothing to do with it. Bernie! <laughs> <laughs> How are you feeling right now? Want to walk you through your emotions? I just never, never once thought that my friends would shit on me so hard. <laughs> Glenn, I gotta say the lowest point for me was like after our conversation in my office when you like hugged you. you? Said, I want to give you a big hug. I was like, <laughs> my best friend Bernie. I can't believe you did this. <laughs> That's like straight villainy right oh, there. Oh god. That's like. Wait, what point is the knife still back there? <laughs> <laughs> that's like Palpatine, like like that's the threshold. Palpatine Decidious right there. That's when I crossed over. Yeah. You know like when you're just like so happy and you just get tunnel vision and it's just like oh god, I feel so much shit of myself talking to the camera about how excited I was. Well I'll see you at work. Uh, <laughs> no! <laughs> hey guys, I hope you enjoy Star Wars on the day it's supposed to come out, not four days early. Um, if you enjoy sci-fi, if you enjoy action, adventure, you should go check out Laser Team. It's Rooster Teeth's first feature film, and tickets are on sale now. So you can go to laserteamthemovie.com, um, you can check out what cities are having screenings, and if there's not a screening in your city, you can organize one through Tug. All the information is on our website, laserteamthemovie.com. Go see it! Go see Star Wars! <laughs> Okay, you'll see it in a couple days.